In a convex quadrilateral ABCD, AB is 10, BC is 14, CD is 11, and DA is 5. Determine the angle between its diagonals. Start by drawing a diagram. So we have quadrilateral ABCD. Let's call this A. ABCD and AB is 10. BC is 14, CD is 11, and AB is 5. Just gonna draw the diagonals too. So the question's asking, I'm trying to find this angle right here. Well, we're given side lengths and we're not given any angles at all. So when you see problems like this, try, you know, playing with the numbers, seeing what works. I see lots of triangles, so I instantly think of the Pythagorean theorem. So try adding the squares of these side lengths and it's not too obvious to see, but you notice that five squared plus 14 squared equals Sorry, that's a 14. <laughs> Equals 10 squared plus 11 squared. And uh, if you calculate it out, it's 221. And we actually do use this later, so just keep that in mind. So we're going to tackle this problem by looking for a contradiction. And let's assume that if we call this, or those two lines meet, if we call this O, let's assume that angle DOC, which is equal to angle AOB is less than 90 degrees. Consider this triangle right here, AOB and DOC. Because we said that angle DOC is less than 90 degrees, these two triangles are acute. And we can say this about acute triangles, that AO squared plus BO squared is greater than AB squared. And again, because this is a cute triangle. Also looking at triangle DOC, we can say that DO squared plus CO squared is greater than DC squared. Okay, so we have these two. Now let's add them. When we add them, we get AO squared plus BO squared plus DO squared plus CO squared is greater than AB squared plus DC squared, which is AB squared 100 plus DC squared 121, which is 221. Now for the other case, that's when we look at these two triangles, triangle AOD and triangle OBC. So we're going to do exactly the same thing as we did in here, except what's different is that because we assume that DOC is acute, and that means this angle is obtuse. So these two triangles are obtuse. Then because they're larger than 90 degrees, we can say AO squared plus DO squared is less than AD squared. Same thing with triangle OBC. We know that BO squared plus CO squared is less than BC squared. So we're going to do the same thing. Add these two what we get is we get the same left hand side as this right here, which would be AO squared plus BO squared plus DO squared plus CO squared, but it's less than 80 squared plus BC squared, which is 5 squared plus 14 squared, which we said here in the beginning is 221. And we were looking for a contradiction and we found it. If you look at this first one right here, we're seeing that these this value is greater than 221. But in our second one, it's saying that this left-hand side, which is exactly the same as this one, is less than 221. And that's not possible, so this is a contradiction. So our original claim that said that this angle DOC is less than 90 degrees is false. And it's going to be the same if you assume that AOD is less than 90 degrees. So they can't be less than 90 degrees, they can't be greater than 90 degrees. So these angles, the angle between the diagonals, must be 90 degrees.